Is it okay that my boyfriend insists on me washing myself before any sexy time? My boyfriend and I have been together for six months, but we've broken up four times. Altogether, we've probably only spent about three months together. He pursued me really hard. We met at work and the first day we met, he asked me out. I kept saying no because I really don't want to focus on guys right now. I have a really good career in fashion, so dating was not in my plans. He kept on insisting and doing very nice things for me, like he would bring me my favorite coffee or bring me my favorite foods. I finally said yes when he brought me a basket full of my favorite snacks from Whole Foods. He told me that he basically went around asking everyone what they saw me eating. And then he went to Whole Foods and bought everything and made a basket for me. I was really flattered, so when he asked me out again, I said yes. I thought maybe he'd be a really, really kind and just considerate guy, but things are not like that. We went on a total of five dates before anything happened. When it finally came time to doing it, we were at my apartment and he insisted that I go take a shower. When I asked him why, he said he prefers for everything to be clean. Obviously, I got offended and said, I am clean. He then rolled his eyes and said, okay, never mind. And then we did it. Part two is up. Is it okay that my boyfriend insists that I wash myself before any sexy time? When he told me he wanted me to be clean, I said I am clean. So we proceeded to do it. Everything was pretty normal after that. He was really affectionate and kept complimenting me. A few days later, it was going to be our second time. But before anything starts to happen, he once again asked me to go take a shower. I asked him if I smelled bad or something. And he said, no, I just think that you should take a shower. I decided to keep my cool and I went and took a shower. But the routine stuck. Every single time we were going to do anything, he would ask me to go take a shower. Now I wonder what you might be thinking. No, I do not smell bad. I usually take two showers a day anyway. One in the morning after working out, and then one at night before getting into bed. So I know I don't smell bad. But now it's a total inconvenience. Every time we want to do it, he asked me to go take a shower. Even if I'm dressed, even if I have makeup on. So I started avoiding it at all costs. Anytime he would ask me to do it, I would just say no. Because of this, we actually broke up for two months. When we got back together, it was the same exact thing. Once again, I was taking a shower every single time. Part three is up. Is it okay that my boyfriend insists on me washing myself before any sexy time? I actually even began associating sexy time with being dirty. Because he would insist so much, I would actually start to feel shame. I knew that I was clean and I washed myself multiple times a day, even when I knew I wasn't going to see him. I decided to reach out to an ex-girlfriend of his on Instagram. Instagram. And I asked her if she had the same problem with him. And she proceeded to send me paragraphs and paragraphs of all the things that he made her do. Not only would he make her shower before sexy time, but he would make her brush her teeth before kissing and fully removing her makeup too. I told her that my theory was that he must have had a bad experience with some other girl. Then she told me her theory, that he likes being in control, and that the only reason he asked us to do all these things was so that he could feel in control. By the way, her and I are now friends, so here's what I did. The next time I saw my boyfriend, I asked him to take a shower. And guess what? He got totally offended. I pulled him up on the fact that he makes me shower every single time, and he said that I should be happy to do whatever it takes to make him happy. Now I refuse to take a shower whenever he wants me to, and because of that, he's always in a bad mood. He even told my best friend that I wasn't a considerate girlfriend. How dare he complain to her? Now here's the thing, I'm very attracted to him and I feel like I'm falling in love with him, but this is the only thing that's holding me back. He even mentioned moving in together, what should I do? Is it okay that my boyfriend is trying to convince me to let him do the dirty with my cousin? My boyfriend used to be my sneaky link before we made it official. At the beginning, neither of us wanted a relationship, but the more we kept hooking up, the more we wanted to be with each other. So naturally, we hung out all the time and he asked me to be his girlfriend. And of course, I really wanted him to ask me, but I would never bring it up myself. So when he finally did, I said yes. But here's the thing. My boyfriend asked me if we could have an open relationship when we started. At first I said no, but then I thought about it some more. If he wants to see other girls and cheat on me, he will. And because of the way we started, I knew what he was like. So I thought to myself, it's probably better to just have an open relationship than to be wondering if he's cheating on me. So after a few weeks of me asking him, I said yes. But I laid down some rules. If he was gonna hook up with somebody else, he needed to tell me. He kept telling me that it was better to just not talk about it, but I told him I wanted to know the truth. A few months into the relationship, everything was fine. According to him, he was not hooking up with anybody. And I know that I wasn't either, even though the option was there if we both wanted to. This is around the time that my cousin came home to visit from college. Growing up, everyone thought that her and I were identical twins. We really do look so much alike. We both have the same exact body type, really similar features. We both have long black hair, and we even dress the same. So it's natural that people thought we were sisters. I told my cousin about my boyfriend and she wanted to meet him. So I had a dinner at my place. As soon as my boyfriend saw her, he basically started drooling. It made me so angry, but I had to keep my cool. Throughout the dinner, my boyfriend kept complimenting her. He talked about how much her and I looked alike and how it would be any guy's fantasy to watch us do it. My cousin was super uncomfortable, so I asked him to stop doing that. Part two is up. Is it okay that my boyfriend is trying to convince me to let him do the dirty with my cousin? Because we have an open relationship, he feels like he can do certain things in front of me. For example, like flirting with other women in front of me. While we were having dinner with my cousin who was visiting, he kept making comments about how hot she was and how her and I look exactly like twins. My cousin was clearly super uncomfortable, so I asked him to stop, which he did. That's when my boyfriend dragged me into our bedroom and asked me if he could do it with her. I said absolutely not. One of the rules in our open relationship is that we can't choose anybody we already know. He told me that he technically did not know my cousin. I told him family was off limits. He asked me to think about it. I drove 
drove my cousin home and that's when she told me that my boyfriend was really hot. And I was shocked. I thought she was uncomfortable at dinner. I pulled the car over and asked her if she was interested in him. That's when she said she overheard our conversation. Yep, she heard when my boyfriend was asking me if he could do it with her. She started to laugh and told me that it was okay and that she wouldn't tell my parents. Then she told me that an open relationship is always a bad idea and that nothing good will come of it. I asked her again if she was interested in him and she said maybe. She says, you should just let us do it. Part three is up. Is it okay that my boyfriend is trying to convince me to let him hook up with my cousin? That's when my cousin tells me you should just let us do it. I looked over at her and I said, are you crazy? And she said, if you guys already have an open relationship, what's the difference? I told her I wasn't going to be comfortable with her and my boyfriend doing it. And that she needed to get that idea out of her head. And she started trying to do reverse psychology on me. She said if I didn't let them do it, that he was going to eventually resent me. And that he would see me as the bad guy. And that he'd probably start looking for other girls. I could not believe that my own cousin was trying to do that to me. I started to cry and I asked her if she loved me at all. She then hugged me and says, of course I love you. This is the best thing for your relationship. Part of me started to actually believe what she was saying. I thought maybe he will resent me if I don't let them do it. After that, I didn't talk to my cousin for a few days. During that time, all my boyfriend did was ask me if he could see her again. I made the mistake of telling him that my cousin was down, and then he started pushing even more. He promised me he would only do it with her once, and that nothing would change between him and I. Here's the other thing. There's a guy who's always asked me out on dates, but I always say no. He contacted me and told me that he was finally single and that he really wants to see me. I told my boyfriend that if he was going to do it with my cousin, then I could do it with this guy. That's when my boyfriend said no, because I had feelings for this guy. He's arguing that he has no feelings for my cousin and that if I do it with this other guy it would be like cheating because I do have feelings for him which is true I don't know what to do and I am so confused I could just go behind my boyfriend's back but part of me feels guilty what should I do